So I'm going to put my hips in, passing this heel past my hip. Okay? And this has to happen quickly. So hips in, past my hip. Now I'm just going to reach in, just like an arm drag, okay? I'm going to grab the back of his leg, or the top of his knee rather, and I'm going to rip this past my body. Okay, again, I'm not going to just use my arm, I'm going to use my whole body to rip. So hips in, past the heel, I'm going to come over cupping the top of his leg, I'm going to rip this past my body, trapping with my armpit over the top of his thigh. At the same time, I'm falling at a 45 degree angle this way, with my knee driving over his bottom leg, trapping his top leg, and I like to block this bicep here, closing my elbow, and now I can either control in this position, drive my hips forward, and kind of perch on my opponent's hips, or we could just use this off this, this position as a basic hub where we can pass his guard, go to the back, or look for submission. Again, so we've beat our opponent's feet. I like the basic posture, structured position for open guard here front arm attached to my leg. Now we notice that there's mobility in this leg. We think we can surprise our opponent. We're gonna pop our hips forward, making posture, passing this, passing this foot so it has a clean line to be pulled past our body. It can't pull into our belly yet. Okay, so posture, hips forward, pass this foot. We're gonna reach, rip, and drive our knee to a 45. Controlling here or bringing the hip forward and perching on our opponent. So, in this pass, we're employing two major theories of getting past our opponent's guard. One, passing in the natural order of our opponent's joints, ankles, knees, hips. Two, is passing to the backs of our opponent's knees. Okay, passing away from where his hips and head are looking. So, again, it's posture position. We can even enter the pass from right here off both the feet, but usually we're going to be coming right here as this is our hub. Okay, now, hips forward, the back leg side passes the, the foot, ripping, trapping behind the knee with our armpit, driving our weight forward to a 45, out of 45. A common um, series of events here is that as I rip past and I trap this knee, I have to have this knee trapped, absolutely have to have this knee behind my armpit, This I, I'm too slow in driving my knee here and my opponent begins to escape his hips and throws this leg over. If this foot touches me, he's going to be able to recompose guard without question. So that's going to give him mobility to face me and put me parallel uh, to his hips, okay? And therefore I'm going to be in guard. So as I rip through, drive, notice I, I have to have this knee trapped and I'm going to, I'm going to intercept this leg coming through. Okay? As I intercept this leg coming through, I take it all the way to the ground. And now I'm just going to drive my hips forward and I'm gonna be able to pop right through at this angle. To pass the guard. Now you can do that slow or fast depending on what your game is. Okay? Once again, I'm gonna rip. I'm too slow. I make him miss. I can even just throw my weight forward here. my opponent from side control.